Hey everybody, this is Glider Cat, and it's time to play. We are back in Per Aspera. We have 622 colonists, which is good. We have 16 food, which is not so good. So we're probably going to start losing colonists if we can't get our food production up. Uh, our advanced ice drilling plant just came online. That should provide more ice. The colonists need that to stick around. But the food, we need chemicals. Let's look at the food factory and see just what we need for that. Refresh my memory here. It's ice and chemicals. So we need ice for the colony building and we need ice for the food building. Uh, let's see if we can find more ice and more chemicals on map. Got a bunch of stuff being constructed here, but I don't think any of this is... Uh, Ice, that's carbon. Iron, carbon, more carbon. We don't need more silicon. We're doing pretty good on that. We've been doing good on that from the beginning. There's chemicals down here. Mm. That might be worthwhile. There's ice. Let's go for this first, the ice. Uh, it's close to where we've got our a bunch of colonists or colonies, so let's do that. This is just a shallow one, though, but we'll go after it. Ice drilling plant, boom. Power, and then let's prioritize the power and prioritize the um, the ice drilling plant. And then uh, we got to check our maintenance situation. We're probably outside. Yep. We got to build that. It's not as urgent. Uh, we can get by for a while without that running. The buildings won't degrade real fast, but we do want to get that up eventually. What do we got here? Uh, carbon, iron. Boy, that's a good spot for a steel mine. Oh. Let's focus on food stuff since we're down to 15. Ice and chemicals. We just saw a chemical plant. Was that here? Yeah. Let's do it. Is that a deep? No, it's a surface. Shallow vein. But we'll do it. Chemicals. And I'll prioritize these two buildings. Chemical mine and the uh, solar farm. Yeah, our food factory is not even running at 100% efficiency, so I'm not as worried about building more of these. They are just hungry for ice and chemicals, and they're not getting it. I could shut down my polymer plant. We've got lots of polymer. Uh, let's just make sure that thing's not on a priority. I'm losing, uh, I think I'm losing citizens here. Let's look at the polymer factory. That is not on priority. We've only got one. I don't think that's a problem for us. Uh, I'm interested in this. And the carbon and the iron, but I just want to focus on food first. We're down to 12 food, iron, silicon, carbon, aluminum, none of that is going to help me with my food situation. Last episode, we chose to research the water supply network. I don't know where there's bodies of water. I'm probably missing something obvious, but I don't see water on this planet. Maybe when we melt the ice cap or something, we'll get some water. Let's check our buildings. Is there anything we're missing? We built one storage center. We probably need to build more of those. Mines, nothing new here. 
factories, we've done pretty much all of that. I don't see anything new. Solar farm, we can unlock more power. We haven't done it yet. Colonies, yeah, nothing much, right? There's another shallow vein of chemicals. It's pretty far away. Iron. Hmm. All right, water, water everywhere. Congratulations, you've unlocked the water treatment and packing plants and the water booster pumps. Now you can create the first water supply network on Mars. Until now, you only produce water from ice. But this technology will allow you to collect water from bodies of water and distribute it to your farms, biodomes, and cities. These structures require a certain amount of running water to function. Connect them to your water treatment plants through pipes. Hmm. Is this recycling water that's already gone through the colony? Connect them to your water treatment plants through pipes. If a structure is too far away, extend your network using water booster pumps. Your water packing plants will convert running water into ice and facilitating the supply of basic colonies and food factories in the later stages of the terraforming plan. All right, let's pick something else. Oxygen release plant releases oxygen. Uh, let's see. Power battery, wind farm. I suppose let's do wind farm. It's easy. It's one we've kind of neglected. Should research up pretty quick. Yeah, let's see about the water plant thing. Easy. Yeah, these colonies. This guy doesn't have anybody in it. That one doesn't either. Power looks good. I'm just checking out our numbers down here. No water. Water supply is zero. Let's see. Factories. Or. Missing something obvious. Colonies. I don't see anything. Life. Here it is. Water treatment plant extracts water from bodies of water and improves its quality. Uh, just don't know where. I'm going to select it and just... Does it give me any clues? Needs to be near water. Is there water anywhere, fellas? There's a warning off to the bottom left saying it needs to be near water. Just looking if that ever goes away. How about near the poles here, fellas? Anything? A okay, wind farm. That's done. All our dust is done. Lead a space mirror's launch the polar orbit to raise the planet's temperature. Maybe this will get us some water. Let's do it. And get back to our factory. How are we doing on food? 10. Not going to be the end of the world or end of the planet or project. It's just going to cause our colonists to start wandering off and slow down our research. Yeah, I don't think we're meant to survive on ice for a long time. We're supposed to be getting water. Let's take a look at the buildings display and just filter to all and see how many we've got under construction at this point. Like one, two, three, four. Not much. So we can do some building. We have a bunch of buildings backed up. This might be a good place to uh, put storage buildings. Let's take a look at a cluster over here. Maintenance facilities are backed up. I don't think we can store maintenance materials. I don't believe in a warehouse. Silicon mine. What about these carbon mines? So maybe let's put a storage building over this way. Not sure where those are at. 
Uh, storage center. Upgrade a road or two while we're out here. Iron doing or steel sixteen. Food's down to ten. I just can't do much about it. Finding lots of silicon. I'm not finding a lot of chemicals. Here's ice drilling plan. I suppose I could prioritize these and maybe they'll fetch the resource from these a little bit more aggressively. I'm not sure if that's how it works or not. We can try it. We've got these roads marked for upgrade. There's a little road here we could upgrade. It's a little tiny segment. Maybe that'll help something. Look at our scanning display. Trying to make a dent here. It looks like we've scanned 3.4.3% of the planet. Got quite a few scanners running. We still have tons of power. Kind of gone overboard on the power. We do have chemicals down here, it looks like. I guess we can expand to the south. A lot of our buildings have been caught up. We don't have a lot of buildings queued up, I mean. Let's do that. If we can get to it. Chemicals, shallow vein, and we'll do iron while we're at it. Chemicals. Iron. on a scanner as well keep that going and then we need maintenance gonna need two maintenance facilities it looks like let's uh, see how we can do this uh almost could almost do one but i think we gotta do two A little imperfect. Uh, hmm. It's something like that. Let's get these all branched up. Like I said, we didn't have a lot of buildings queued up, so I think it's safe to do some of this. Oh, we got our wind farm now. Let's use that. Boom. That should be good enough over there, I think. All right, got a bunch of stuff queued up over here, and we just uncovered a few more resources. Well, let's go after these two. They're all in the umbrella of our maintenance. We got iron, and is that coal or carbon? Iron and carbon. Okay, we just completed a mission or project. Let's do sector eight. Okay. I gotta find where we were. I think we were exploiting some new mines. Where were those? Down here, maybe. Iron, right? Not a big mine, but we'll take it. 
see if it's in the power network. Uh, it is not. But it will be, right? Uh, maybe not. Not sure. Let's uh, grab more power. Wind farm. This may be a different part of the map than I was thinking it was. All right, we'll see what happens there. Uh, let's go back to eight times speed, the event. When we get an event of a mission completed or something, it seems like the game takes us down from our accelerated game speed to back down to one, one time speed. Easy to forget to kick it back up. Foods at 21. Did we lose people? I think we're okay on people. <clears throat> I'm starting to lose my voice. All right, Space Mirror Ray, a fleet of Space Mirrors launched in polar orbit to raise the planet's temperature. Okay, good. I like it. Additional landing sites, I'm uh, not compelled yet, but it looks like we... No, we don't. What is this? Quartz greenhouse gases, importation. Why can't I do these yet? Do they want me to complete everything in this area first? Maybe. Go ahead and research that. It's quick. Even if we don't use it, it's probably worth doing. There's our first little storage building. Let's see how it, yeah, we're making use of it. Look at parts. Parts have rebounded. Happy about that. Aluminum. More iron and carbon. This is a good place for a steel plant. We could probably go after that. Okay, here's something we just completed. Okay, another sector unlocked. Let's do... 11. And let's make sure we've got improved roads going down to this construction area. How about from you all the way down to here, maybe? And then you to here. You down to here. Okay, let's speed up the game again eight times. Ice. Deep vein of ice. Kind of want to go after that. Let's just do it. Uh, we could maybe pick up this silicon on the way. Okay, we completed the additional landing sites. Okay, it looks like I still can't research these. There must be... Yeah, there must be a, some kind of game dynamic to that that I'm not aware of yet. Be nice if it said... what it was, but I'm not sure why. Maybe we have to get everything to level... I don't know. I really don't know. Let's do space. Get all these done. Engineering, extra storage is done. Wind farm's done. Kind of want to do fastest, <laughs> fastest roads. Let's do it. Okay, I was in the process of putting down some power. We'll standardize on the wind farms. More road that can be upgraded. Let's do it. What are we doing? 45 out of 61 workers. I'm not really paying attention to this display up here at the, uh, in the top left. It shows us the temperature and the greenhouse gases. Hopefully that's climbing. Pressure looks like it's climbing slowly. And then our, what is this? 
Frozen carbon dioxide. That one is decreasing. The polar caps are rich in frozen carbon dioxide. Sublimate these caps to pressurize the atmosphere. Okay. So hopefully that's all moving the terraforming forward. And I'm sure this display probably tells me what it is, but I can't be bothered at the moment. Looking at resources, what we're short on. Looks like chemicals. Not aluminum. Let's take a look at our scanners and make sure those are all like doing well. They don't have efficiency ratings, so I'm assuming they just keep working and have unlimited range. That's going to be my guess. Let's take a look at the scanning display. Yeah, they're all doing their thing. Even these ones that are way in in the interior are still scanning blocks for us. So that is good. And it's kind of going at a pretty good pace because we've been able to consistently keep building. So we're not waiting on the scanners. The deep vein of iron, aluminum, shallow vein of carbon. We've been over there several times. Let's check the maintenance one more time. Everything is covered or about to be covered. I would like more food-related resources. Oh, these guys aren't covered. These guys are not covered by maintenance. Let's take care of that. And we got a new building here, too, I got to look into. Let's uh, do one thing at a time. Will that cover everybody? I think so. And then will it have enough power? Can't tell. Maybe. Let's uh, shore things up around there. There's a mine. We'll take it. It's more silicon, which we don't really need. Maybe this area is good for storage, too. I'll put a storage center over here somewhere. Okay, we just got another sector unlocked. Not many left. 12, 12 or 7, do 12, ooh, that must be a dust devil, now is this a point of interest, finally, let's, uh, I haven't been paying attention to those, did I miss some obvious things here? Just scanning for points of interest here that I missed. Sure seems like I would have, right? Let's uh, pop a research center here. That's one of the few things we haven't done. Research outpost. Boom. These guys need... I think they're going to need food. Let's build out to that. And then let's look at our new building here down here. We haven't done... Oh, no, this is the water stuff. Yeah, we're waiting. Greenhouse gas factory. Just don't have enough chemicals to build more of those. Uh, let's go back to eight times speed. Let's see if we've got any mines that have gone empty or exhausted mines. Curious about that. Ooh, what's this one? Deactivated. What's that? Uh, it's usually... Let's see if that's an exhausted mine. Yeah, nothing. Nothing left. Uh, okay. Shows resources need to start production. I guess we can just scrap this, right? Let's do it. Mark that for being scrapped. If there's any more of those, we can scrap. Construction in progress. Oh, yeah. Another one deactivated. 
can't scrap them from here. It looks like I need to go to them to do it. Okay, there's a chemical plant, and if I get this out of the way, yeah, zero. Scrap it. Ice drilling plant. Scrap it. Iron mine down here. Pretty sure these are all going to be empty. Yeah, scrap it. I don't think if I throw an advanced mine, we're going to get anything. Could be wrong. Another iron mine to scrap here. Yeah, and we prioritized our ice mines, trying to move more ice. Don't know if that helped or not. Tempted to do that with the chemical mines. Let's do it. Let's increase the priority on these. In fact, let's increase the build on that one. Okay. Unlocked sector 11. Not much left. Seven. Food's at 20. Colonists are at 828. That's pretty good. Carbon mines backed up. Food factory. Oh, let's speed up time again. And what about... Another storage building. Stage two buildup. Continue heating the planet. Melt the permafrost onto the regolith and raise pressure to 300 millibars. Aluminum, silicon. Ooh, there's more chemicals. Shallow vein. Hummer. Uh, this was something we abandoned, it looked like. Maintenance. Silicon mine. Let's, uh, finish this. Probably got interrupted. Chemicals, right? And we can upgrade some roads through here. Boom, all the way out to there, maybe. Yeah, we've got a second level of road upgrades coming, but it's got quite a bit of research left to do. We're a thousand research points in and we need 2,500. So about 1,500 more and we'll have that. Food's holding steady, I think. I don't know if we're losing population to balance it. We need water and we need more chemicals. Steel's okay. Polymers are looking good. You know, there could be other biomes that have a bunch of the stuff we need been kind of exploring slowly let's go let's make a push north if we can how are we doing on the scanning uh, okay let's push north Tons of surplus power. I'm throwing it down because I don't think there's a maintenance cost to running these once they're in place. And I could be mistaken. I don't want to 
gonna move up. Let's do another scanner. Oh, it would have been nice. Oh, that'll do. Just looking at the roads, seeing what makes sense to upgrade. I guess that's what this display is for, right? Alright, another sector down. What do we have left? Not much. Uh, sp oh, Space Mirror Ray. Let's get that going. I didn't realize we had to launch a rocket for that. Uh, and then additional landing site. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. Shoot, I wish we would have got the uh, Space Mirror Ray going a little faster. That doesn't take much time, though. Ooh, 38 aluminum. And 38 glass. We've got plenty of glass. Whoop. We're doing a maintenance over here. Did I cover this? Nope. Let's do it. A lot of construction stuff going on down here. Let me just check the roads. Oops, got to speed up again. Food's holding. We've got 833 colonists. Making some progress on faster roads. Scanners are trying to do their thing. I'd like to keep pushing north, but we kind of would like to have it scanned before we go. See if we can prioritize a scanner to get built. Water. This lens shows the bodies of water in the water supply network. These bodies of water? Height. It says height. Hmm. I don't think there's any bodies of water here yet. At least not that I can tell unless this is, but I think that's a big mountain, right? If we turn this way, there's no body of water there.
Here's our little research outpost. Anybody show up? No, we've only got... Let's, uh... Hmm. Let's prioritize that. It'll at least get its supplies, and then maybe we'll get some people coming. And they're researching an abandoned electronics facility. What are we doing electronics? Uh, we're doing okay. Raw resources. We've got plenty of iron. we got plenty of carbon. We could probably do another steel plant somewhere, right? Let's see the productivity of our steel plants right now. I doubt they're maxed out. Uh, steel factory one, 71%, 99% and 94%. We could probably get some more steel with another plant. Where do we want to put it? Can't remember where all the steel stuff is. Got two wind farms down here. That's probably overkill. Maintenance, worker hub, wind farm. Advanced iron mine. Let's put a steel plant over here near this iron mine. It's got 5,000 units left to mine. Factory, steel factory, anywhere is fine. Anywhere you'll fit. That's close-ish. That storage is being made use of, which is good. That one is too. Guess we can put another one down. Hey, we're about 412, 400 research points away from having faster roads. Maintenance view looks good. Ooh, a little bit we're missing over here. Let's uh, do it. This might take a couple of bubbles. Hmm. Now let's try it there. We'll see. Might be good enough. Worker hubs. Sure. And that guy should have... No, just out of the range of our power. Power, wind farm. Pop this down here. And then... Maintenance, and I'm going to put another scanner in. Food down to 10. Research need about 200 more. We're good. We'll kick off another research project. Uh, carbon. Iron, aluminum, aluminum, iron. We don't really need that stuff. Although this carbon and iron, we could turn into a nice, another steel factory over this way. Okay. There goes sector seven. What's left? Nothing. Additional landing site. I'm not going to bother with that. Start a new base. What we could do is bring more colonists down. We've got room for them. We don't have a lot of food though. I think I'm going to stick with just one spaceport doing uh colonist migration so we're just they're just gonna go back to earth if i don't have um enough food little factories three additional factories needed one for food maybe let's take the advice here and do that uh speed things up again What a food factory near the uh, ice plant here. 
Okay. Yoda Electronics Factory Research Outpost. Research completed. Report. It was an Israeli Mars station that studied the corrosion resistance of electronics when exposed to the Martian environment. They designed a new electronical, ele electrical component suitable for developing electronics on Mars. It's thanks to their work that we have light, heat, air, and many other commodities in our habitats. Nice. So we completed the research. I want to get a food factory down. Prioritize that. So I think that research facility just keeps working and it kicks out research like a regular one would. Did we research the advanced habitats? I don't know. No, because we can't upgrade them yet. Uh, that might be something we want to do next here. We're just about done with the current research project. Power declined a little bit. We're still looking good at 338 megawatt surplus. Workers are getting built slowly but surely. We got 57 in motion. Almost a thousand colonists at 930. Let's wrap this one here. Uh, yeah, let's wrap this one here and then we'll probably pick a new research next episode. Or we can pick it right now. <laughs> let's pick it right now since we got it coming up. Tech tree, fastest roads or faster roads. I'm curious what it takes to get past this wall here. They're not going to let me research these things. I'm not sure if you have to complete all this stuff before you can move forward. Is there any more terraforming? It doesn't look like. We got the polar dust. We got the space mirror. Nothing on this one that we can, uh, that we can do. Biotech. Superior colonies. That's what I was looking at. Let's, can we not do that? Why? Why can we not do that? But oh, we did do it. Oh, no, we didn't even do the first one. Let's do that. Advanced colonies. Yeah, and then we will uh, pick it up next episode for Analysis of Glider Cat saying thanks so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode.